You're about to see a dangerously close call on the Taiwan Strait. Video, courtesy of Global News, shows a Chinese warship, the one on the left, headed toward the path of an American destroyer. The U.S. ship slows down just in time, narrowly avoiding a collision. At one point, the vessels were only 137 meters apart, less than the length of two football fields. That is a really dangerous thing to do. I mean, we're talking a very short distance. Uh, something could go terribly wrong. The American destroyer had been on a routine patrol of international waters alongside a Canadian frigate, HMCS Montreal, when the incident happened, and follows another close call about a week earlier. A Chinese fighter jet performing an aggressive maneuver in international airspace above the South China Sea. All of it underscoring the escalating tensions in the region. A key topic at this weekend's high-profile defense summit in Singapore. Conflict in the Taiwan Strait would be devastating. The U.S. called China's actions irresponsible, urging decision makers to rein it in. Canada echoing the message. Well, I hope that the feedback is taken seriously. But Beijing pointed a finger back at Washington, claiming the Americans are in spaces they have no right to be, accusing the U.S. of provocative actions. It is undeniable that a severe conflict or confrontation between China and the U.S. will be an unbearable disaster for the world. Efforts to reset the China-U.S. relationship don't appear to be working. A top U.S. national security advisor says at some point, President Biden will meet with Chinese President Xi Jinping. But there's no timeline and no public plan. Katie Simpson, CBC News, Washington.